Hi, my name is Dr. Dina Hinshaw and I want to talk to you today about wearing masks. When you're choosing a mask, it's like choosing a tool. You have to choose the right tool for the right job. If I wanted to cut a board, I wouldn't use a hammer, I'd use a saw. And just like that, I wouldn't use an N95 mask for going out in public because those masks are meant for medical professionals in places where aerosolizing procedures are being performed. So out in public, you can use a general procedural mask or you can use a cloth mask. It's really important also to know how you use the mask because just like I wouldn't turn a saw upside down to cut a board, if you wear a mask incorrectly, it actually won't protect you. So first of all, what is the right uh, tool for the job of protecting others? That is the non-medical mask. If you think about in the winter when you breathe out and you can see that cloud of droplets coming out of your mouth, it's that cloud that you're trying to keep in by using a non-medical mask. It's important that when you wear the mask, it's covering your nose and your mouth. It's not sitting on your neck, it's not sitting on your head, it's not only on your mouth, it's covering your nose and mouth because that is the right way to use that tool of a mask to protect others from you and your, the droplets that you breathe out. It's also really important to not touch your face, to not scratch your nose under the mask because you can still potentially contaminate yourself even if you are wearing a mask if you do that.